everyone, it's Holly. Welcome back to my channel. It's the final episode of my love story with Yamada-kun and I'm not ready for it to be over. And I am just so glad that I reacted to this show because I think it's increased in popularity over the weeks. I'm assuming that happens with a, a lot of shows that come out like once a week, but it really felt like at the start of this show coming out, it really felt like not many people were reacting to it. So I am really, really glad it's now built up enough popularity that we might be getting a second season. I honestly don't know. However, I saw an announcement that the anime expo i think it's in july i think the team that made this they've got an announcement or the writer has an announcement so i'm hoping like one of two things i mean i would love both of these things but i'm happy for one or the other first of all i am hoping that they are considering a second season kind of like what they did with my dress up darling i hope they're gonna be like surprise season two is in the works i hope they either do that or i hope they finally release the manga in english translated copies there are volunteers who have done it online however i would just really love to have the physical books and i would love to collect something like that so we will see i'd be happy with either but okay so last episode i felt so bad for subaki i felt like i had been a bit harsh on her previously and now i'm kind of realizing why her little sort like side story is so important because it actually plays into what i'm going to assume is yamada and akane's like confessions hey. Oh, it is. It's not supposed to be like that. It's not supposed to be one sided, so I do feel for her. お。大人<笑><笑> Oh my god, she's being like very <laughs> She's being very direct. It's so hard like being that vulnerable in front of someone. She knows he doesn't like her. Oh, it's the drawing! Oh! <gasps> This scene is beautiful. Oh, and the music. It's just it's just been done so well. <laughs> yes. Uh, yes, that's my boy. Come on. Wow. Oh my gosh, that was such a beautiful scene. That wasn't Akane, was it? Oh. Oh. She's so cute as well. Like her cute blushy cheeks. I feel like she's come out of her shell. 
Oh, good for her. Honestly, good for her. I I can't really say much more than that. <gasps> Runa. Oh, I love Runa so much now. Calbi, I don't know what that is. あいつ忙しいからなかなか会う機会もないでしょ。いやこの間告白できなかったの。いいのいいの。私今日お肉食べに来たからいらっしゃいませ。ようやくしたカモタです。お待ちしておりました。Oh <笑> あいつ受験なんて余裕ぶっかましてるよ。そうなの?じゃあこの間そう見えたのは気のせいかな。なんと高そうなお店だね。お肉高いのかな。ルナちゃん声小さい。ルナちゃん声小さい。ルナちゃ
やすみなさい<笑> Okay that's great that's great that was great but I like can we have something What now? Didn't sleep. Oh, my God. Then, eh, somebody in Nangiga eat I cut the year to ne. Okay。Right, hold on. Hold on. Can I say something that I've noticed? I feel like in this episode they've animated his mouth more so that you can tell if he's like smiling or smirking or I don't know if it's just me that's noticed that, but he, like, he's got more character in his face because now he's not just got this, like, blank stare. They, they're, like, animating his mouth more. Oh, my God. <laughs> Yes? Oh. Oh my gosh, from the start! Oh my So he did pay a little more attention than what we thought. Oh my god. Uh, I was silent for the second half of this because I was fully taking it in. I think it worked perfectly. I think what we got worked perfectly. I think you could probably tell by my reaction, but I felt like that hug, it was such a close hug. And listen, I... I am I am beyond excited to start reading it but I have heard things about the manga and if you know what I'm talking about you know and I feel like him being like oh like your canines are really pointy like that for me makes me think of something like way deeper than just like holding hands and stuff so and like just the way he looked at her and was like mm. Yeah, I was thinking about how cute they are. Like, it, it's very playful. It's very, like, they have so much, like, I've said this the whole time. They have so much sexual chemistry. It's unreal. Like, unreal. I am so sad that this is the last episode. Does it have to be? But that does mean now that I'm going to read the manga. I'm sorry to say, everyone. Like, I would love to say to you all, I'm going to wait until we get a second season or whatever. But I am not that girl. I am not that girl, okay? I am like all of you and I also need to know what happens in these stories because it actually pollutes my mind. That was adorable and I am just so unbelievably happy and you know the thing I really loved about this show and I know that not everyone enjoyed that but I really like the fact that there was a lot of like guild 
time it wasn't just that it like it was it's a big part of like both of their relationship is a big part of the dynamic of the whole show and i'm glad they actually played into that you know because yeah of course it could have just been about their relationship but i think the bigger picture is it's about all of their relationships together like coexisting in a space that's quite precious and you know i've mentioned before how i've been in that kind of environment before and it's it's a very like special thing and it's it's full of lots of interesting people and stories and relationships and i have very much enjoyed this show i have very much enjoyed seeing the parallels i mentioned this in my first reaction to this show but i actually met my partner on an mmo like foz and we are like very very similar like our personalities are very similar to the characters so it's been kind of funny watching that unfold thank you so much everyone for watching my reaction i do not have any plans to replace this show if you did want to have a look at what my schedule looks like um in the community tab there should be something that confirms kind of what i'm watching and i will see you in my next video goodbye